If you run a Shopify store, you already know the feeling of having to switch over from softwares that are pivotal to your business. But the reality is that unfortunately, some softwares just get way too expensive and there's just better options out there. And in today's video, I wanna discuss OmniSend and why I'm switching all my stores over to it. And I'm trying to also switch all our clients that do email marketing to OmniSend. And this is actually one example right here that we set up. And I wanna talk about how you can actually do this in a few minutes if you already have a Shopify store, but also if you don't have a Shopify store, how you can start your Shopify store with OmniSend already all set up. And a quick heads up, this video is sponsored by OmniSend, but I'm only doing it because I genuinely use it on all of my stores. First and foremost, like I mentioned, switching email platforms is literally a nightmare. And the reason why is because there are flows, there are contacts, segments, tags that you already have set up for your store. So if you've been driving traffic, you've probably developed different segments of people, people that have bought from your store, people that have visited, people that have added to cart. And once you collect those people, you know, let's say importing them to a different platform, it's a nightmare. So what OmniSend does, which is super cool, and this is like, honestly, the main reason why I love them, they are just so much better at giving you real support. So I have an example here. Um, and in their support chat, this is, I've literally done this, you can just basically message them, um, you know, right here, for example, and tell them, I want to migrate from, you know, let's say Clavio, right? And they'll literally book a call with you and migrate everything over tags, everything. So how this works is, let's say you want to import your contacts, let's say click add or updated contacts, you can literally import all your contacts from Clavio and it just basically syncs everything up for you so that you can start sending out emails right away. Now, as I showed you right here, here's like the craziest stat when it comes to email marketing and I'm not gonna lie, I didn't really think about this fully until pretty much this year, which is a little embarrassing, but email marketing constitutes about 30% of revenue or at least 10% for a lot of stores. And that's a huge amount, right? Now, here's the crazy part. You spend about a dollar uh, to make $68 on OmniSend. That's like a literal stat uh, on OmniSend is that you can spend a dollar and make $68 back. Now, of course, that doesn't mean that it's not the same with ads, right? It's not the same as ads. The the reason why is because this is from your existing list. But let's just speak hypothetically here. You know, we all know a million different stores that, um, you know, we actually do a lot of research on this channel on a variety of stores and all of them use email pop-ups, right? But what that means is you're collecting emails without people buying anything. So you can make a lot of money from those people. And here's just a like real tangible example. So here is a client that we had this was actually an accelerator member. So somebody that joined our Shopee Lab Accelerator, so our platform and our one-on-one -on -one accelerator program, which is basically you get you know support from me, from our coaches and from our agency team to not only get feedback on every product, get feedback on all your ads, but we also do discounted servicing from our agency team. So we were able to set up email marketing for this client that he literally didn't have set up and instantly that same week, we were able to make 20K. We only charged about $750 for this. Um, and it made back $22,000 in revenue, which is pretty unbelievable. And that's the cool thing about email. And one of the biggest reasons why I think people sleep on it is because it's kind of a pain to set up. Like, you know, when you're a business owner, you have to wear so many different hats. You have to market the business, do research, build, you know, the, the site. Email marketing tends to fall behind. Uh, and that's why I really love the AI features of OmniSun 2, because basically it allows you to already have your stores set up if you're a beginner. So whether you're not a beginner or a beginner, basically, if you just go here to the main goals, for example, OmniSun's AI already, once you sync your store to it, analyzes your store data so that it can pretty much automate everything for you. Like you can do all your flows in a few clicks, you can do your campaigns in a few clicks. Of course, I would suggest that you spend a little bit of time on those things, um, make your flows even better than what the AI would do. I'm sure over time though, it'll get so good to where you can just talk to the AI 
and have it, you know, be like an agent, right? An agentic uh, email marketing, basically like an employee. So that's what's cool. But again, the main way that you're going to be able to seamlessly migrate to Omnisend is just literally talking to the support, which is such a breath of fresh air. You know, like I love when you talk to a support chat and you're not getting, uh, you know, you're actually able to get real support like get on a call with somebody to help you migrate. Now, this is only available to people that are spending over $250 a month on an email marketing software, which is pretty easy to do actually when you spend, a lot of the softwares out there are really expensive. I'll just put it that way. Um, but yeah, make sure that you do that. The other thing I wanted to highlight um, is, well, first and foremost, we have a pretty big code here for our channel. So shout out to Omnisend. We have a great partnership partnership with them and you know you're going to be able to get 30 percent off for three months so not only are you saving money on your just existing subscription where you can migrate everything over but you can also save 30 percent off for three months with code re30 and this is an affiliate code i get a kickback when you do that but again you're also getting a discount so there's really no reason to not use it if you want to support the channel but you don't have to of course now What's really interesting to me is how much profit you can literally print with email marketing. And this is why I mentioned at the beginning that I, it's a little embarrassing that I didn't think about this more thoroughly sooner. But basically, if you're driving, let's say, even just 10% of revenue from email, that revenue is like 100%. It's basically all profit. You're not spending money on this revenue except for whatever you're paying for Omnisend, which is pretty cheap. You know, like I mentioned, it's about a dollar for $68 in ROI. That's a crazy stat. So the sooner you set this up, the sooner you're going to be able to take a breather from your ads, right? It makes your ads do better or not better, but it makes it so that you can do better in your overall business with the same ad performance. And that's the biggest hack that I've discovered this year is something that's been around for forever, which is email marketing. Um, but for me, the reason I never really wanted to set it up on my own stores is because first of all, it's a pain. Um, and second of all, I just never really thought it was that necessary. I always put a much bigger emphasis on ads because I have an ad agency and we never did email marketing for clients until this year. And you know, that's why we do it. Um, so I just always put a bigger emphasis on ads and I still do. I still think putting a bigger emphasis on growth is always a good idea, but profits matter a lot. And we're seeing it this year. A lot of big e-commerce businesses are going down because of tariffs and because of ad costs and just in general, things are getting more expensive as a whole. So a lot of e-commerce businesses, you know, that were at 5% profit margins, they're getting pretty screwed. But the ones that are the most profitable tend to be the ones that are running strong email marketing campaigns. And that actually provide value. That's the other thing I really like about email marketing um, is that it's actually a really easy place to provide genuine value to your list, right? Because let's say in a particular example, let's say you're selling some sort of health product, some sort of weight loss product. What you can do is you can provide free tips, right? You can provide workout ideas, meal ideas, things like that to your list and see really good results, make your people happy, make your list happy and actually build a community around your business. Um, so that's one of the biggest hacks I would say is send out more valuable campaigns in your email list. Uh, like I said, I, I'm not an email expert here. I'm still learning about this, but just from the little bit of email marketing that we've been doing at my agency, I'm seeing like crazy results and it's just so easy to get these people an ROI with email marketing, especially when they've never done it before. So I want to just tell you to do it from the get-go uh, and like I mentioned you can migrate everything over from your existing email marketing software that's probably more expensive for nothing like it's literally free just talk to the chat support and like I said just mention I want to migrate over to Omnisend and they'll literally set up a call with you and migrate everything over with all the tags all the segments all your contacts seamlessly it's amazing uh, and of course lastly use my code RE30 if you want to save money on Omnisend. If you don't want to send money on, save money on Omnisend, then don't use it. Uh, but I highly recommend that you use it. I actually forgot that they have an agency partner program. I should get in there because yeah, like I mentioned, we've been 
doing this for a few clients and it's been pretty transformational, um, especially for the people in the Shopee Lab Accelerator. But yeah, the main flows that you should set up, like the ones that I actually made a recent video about this, so I'll link it in the description too. But there's some really easy flows that you can set up. Your welcome series flow, your abandoned cart flow, your abandoned checkout flow, and your browse abandonment flows. And those you can all do automatically with Omnisend AI. So like I mentioned, when you set up your Omnisend, it browses your store, it gets your real data, and then uses it to give you preset flows that you can basically just turn on. Uh, you can also use it for copywriting, all these different things, brand asset AI, that's actually interesting. Uh, of course, you can do some of these things with just Claude or ChatGPT too, but it's really nice to have it all in one place. So yeah, that's pretty much about it. I wanted to share some more results here with you so that you can you know, pretty much see like one of the easiest places to get an ROI. I want you guys to get an ROI from my channel, right? Like I want you guys to be able to gain knowledge uh, and follow along with me as I continue to learn too and learn together with me. That's actually the most fun that I have and why I love to do the research videos. I love to learn with you guys, believe it or not, in most of my research videos, I'm doing that research in real time. Like I do a little bit of research ahead of time so that I have some good things to show you right away, but I also dive deeper and kind of like go down the rabbit hole in the video. So it makes it really fun. But that's about it for this video. Hopefully you got some value out of it and make sure that if you are thinking about email marketing and you're thinking about cutting costs, which is always a good idea actually to just be on top of your costs, think about switching to Omnisend. I'm doing it on all my stores. I'm setting it up on all my stores. I'm setting it up for clients, for the accelerator members. And yeah, it's just cheaper, just as good if not better. Their AI systems are really strong and they have incredible support that will literally help you migrate everything over in a call. So pretty unbelievable. That's about it though. Make sure you use my code if you want to save money and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.